Hey, what's going on you guys? If you couldn't already tell from the title of the video, um, today we're going to be looking at the Vans and Nightmare Before Christmas collab. Um, this was a collab all the way back in 2019. Um, so as of right now, it's two years old. Um, and today we're just going to be looking at the Skate High Silhouettes, uh, which came out in three different colorways. You got the Christmas Town, Jack's Lament, and then Sally's Potion. Um, but we'll go ahead and take a detailed look at all three of these shoes. All right, you guys, we're going to go ahead and start with the box. Um, as Anytime Vans does a collaboration, they uh, don't spare any attention to detail. Um, so right away on the box, you have a, what looks like a gift wrap. Um, it's very reminiscent of Jack's suit. Um, that's kind of the seam down the middle, um, as well as the bat bow tie, um, which is super iconic in the show itself. Um, it has a tag that's already uh, printed onto the box, so you can actually send that to someone if it's a gift. And then opening up, uh, all the pairs I did buy are coming from StockX for the most part. Um, you got the cool jack-o'-lantern tissue paper, um, and then on the inside box lid, um, you have the governor um, and some of the town folk driving around there. Alright, first up we're going to be looking at Jack's Lament. Um, this is arguably the best colorway out of the Skate High silhouettes. Um, it does feature the most glow-in-the-dark panels. Um, it's going to be the off-white neon colors you see. Um, but my most favorite part of the shoe is that both the outside panels are mismatched as well as the inside panels. So all four are different. Um, Vans tends to do this a lot on some of their shoes. It's the only shoe in the set that has all four panels being mismatched. Um, it also has the Easter egg nice work bone daddy on the heel liner. Um, and then that would be the only relatively different thing from all the other shoes. It just says the Nightmare Before Christmas on the insoles and then nothing on the bottom soles. All right, next up we have Sally's Potion, also on the Skate High Silhouette. Um, again, this shoe is going to have the glow-in-the-dark panels. It's going to be the off-white um, textured um, portions. You can obviously see what those are. Again, this shoe also has mismatched panels. Um, the two outside ones are going to be the same on this shoe, um, but on the inside, you got the mismatched potions, frog's breath, um, obviously on that one, and then a beautiful butterfly which in the movie I believe turns into a scary face at some point um, again nothing too crazy um, on the bottoms back heel lines are blank both the inside tongues um, on this one you actually are gonna have the professor I don't know his name um, in the wheelchair on that one and then the exact same insoles um, as Jack's Lament um, so you do have one Easter egg on the inside um, tongue on the right shoe. Um, so again, tons of cool attention to detail. The Sally's Potions and the Jack's Lament are going to be the only two shoes which feature the glow-in-the-dark panels. Um, so obviously those are going to be the two kind of most desirable ones out of the set. They're obviously a lot more easier to wear with the black and white um, color scheme. All right, moving on to the last shoe. All right, you guys, lastly, we're going to be looking at the Christmas Town colorway. Um, again, this one's more of a, I'd say, Christmas vibes as opposed to the Halloween color scheme. Um, it's got the red tongue toe cap, uh, which makes it very reminiscent of like an ugly Christmas sweater. Um, in my opinion, super hard shoe to wear. Um, it's automatically going to be my least favorite um, out of the bunch. Um, again, going off with the different panels, um, the inside of one shoe is going to match the outside of the other. Um, so it does have two different images on either side. Um, still a super cool shoe. You got the Christmas trees on the back. There is an Easter egg on this shoe. Um, you got the little um, elves on one tongue. Um, still the same insole. And then you got the wild laces, just the extra black ones. Um, one cool thing about this shoe is when I first found it, I actually picked up a sample pair. Um, so this is going to be a shoe sample. I don't know if I'm going to be able to find the tongue in there. Um, so there's actually the uh, tag. And then if you can catch the inside sample. Um, so when I first found this shoe, I thought it was an unreleased colorway. 
um, but turns out it was just a Journeys exclusive. Um, so it did end up dropping about a week after I found it on uh, eBay. Um, so on a sample it is uh, with Vans, they always do mint size nine, almost always. And then each uh, shoe actually has one of the extra laces as opposed to the G, uh, uh, GR had uh, the tags and extra laces just on one shoe. Um, otherwise no known differences um, from the actual release. Alright guys, well that was the end of the video. Thank you so much for hanging out. Uh, let me know in the comments which one you guys think was the best colorway out of the Skate High Silhouettes. Um, and if you're not already following, do hit that subscribe button. Um, I do try and put out a video each and every week. Do feel free to check out my website, fetishforthesekicks.com. All the links below work. Um, unfortunately, you will not find um, these Nightmare Before Christmas shoes on our website or eBay. Um, but tons of other stuff to look at. Um